Well, my little beauties, it's absolutely piddling it down out there. Uh, I've just run in. So this week's collection mm, is um, calipers. Mm, Buck and Hickman Limited, London calipers. So there's a set of calipers, plain and no markings, but that's okay. Um, we'll put that one there. But this one, this one, look at this one. We've got the uh, the, the crow's foot. We've got 60 there, but I haven't got one with AM. Again, Buck and Hickman. Can you see that, Buck and Hickman? Yeah. And AM, Air Ministry. I haven't got Buck and Hickman, London. AM, I haven't seen that marking before. AM, it's got the crow's foot. The number 60. Hmm. All adds, all adds to the um the collection. Now <laughs> my ampetitis continues. Now in a, in and of itself, it's okay, but this just it's a, just an another addition. Just another addition. It's got the leads to go with it. It's just another addition to the uh, collection so in of itself it's its own thing in really really good nick but uh, it just adds to the collection and what i like about this one is see the mini test um now it's very faint and i don't know if you're going to see it but it says can you see mini test so it's the um it's the correct thing in it's the correct case that goes with it it's not just a case they found and put it in let me just put this down a minute so that's why um i think that's uh, that's nice mm. so let's put that down there all right now to this week's piece de resistance mm. this now look at this now this is a proper puzzle i've flattened let's see if I, oh there's no room on that on my bench, right. Are we ready? Are we ready? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Now, this is quite a puzzle. See? It's got on here number 13. Number 13. There doesn't seem to be any name or anything. It's good quality. Um, the reason... I think it's... Where did that come out of? Oh, yeah. The reason... Now, you can see... They're really in really good nick. There's a few of them you can see that's been replaced with names which come from another set. But you see this? Do you see the fineness? How fine that is. This is... This is really quality and really heavy. Hmm... It's got a number two on that there. Now here it is, look. This is really heavy. And can you see the the finish on it? Um, I don't know if it was meant to be that finish. It's, um, can you see the, the markings or the, the, can you, I don't know if you can quite see it. But again, there's no name. There's no, yeah, there we are. You can see that better now, can't you? Can you see it? Hmm, that's really unusual. What is that? And again, 13, look. But again, this really quality and weight, it's really heavy. So, <coughs> no manufacturers, just this 13. Whitworth, and if you go into these, this has got 12 on it look so this one can we see it come on can we see it it's got the 12 on it so that's a bit of a what does that mean 13 no maker's name just number 13 on it hmm that's a one and why is this finish here and this 
looks proper quality. So anyway, it's really in good nick. The box for the age, that's, that hasn't had a lot of use. That hasn't had much use at all. And the box in really good nick and well made look. And we've got a box similar to this, haven't we? When we turn it around and we look at the back, we've got a box with that cutout. Very similar, haven't we? The box is not, many boxes have that. Let's see if we can find the box with that same, uh, see that hasn't got it. That hasn't got it. Is it this one now? It's this one. It's one of the smaller white cut ER. That's the one, see? Almost the similar sort of stain on it. I wonder if it's uh Hmm. So um <laughs> Where am I gonna put this one? <laughs> the next question is where am I gonna put this box? And how are we gonna make this box fit the rest of the collection of boxes? Hmm. There's even some around there. Hmm. Don't worry. I'll find a place. So anyway, um, yeah, that's this week's uh, hunter gathering.